first I have to ask you about principal photography on Justice League proper because I don't I don't really know your your schedule and how everything kind of fell out with that. So you, know, you were kind of touching on this earlier. As an actor, you only have so much control over everything. So where was your mind at when you found out that Zach wasn't going to get to finish the film? Had you already shot your stuff? Is is it what were you shooting later on in the production process? What what exactly happened there? I'd already shot my stuff. And um, then I hear the tragic and almost inconceivably awful news. Um, and as a mother, as a parent, um, it was, that was just like, oh my God, I, my heart just went out to him and to Deborah. And I just felt like that's just something that, uh, you know, and any one of us would have such a hard time to recover from, you know, from something like that. I felt so sad for him. I know how family oriented they are. They have the kids around them to come on set. You know, they're really so family oriented for them to go through that terrible, awful trauma was, was horrific. To therefore have to step away from the film um, was also horrific and not be able to finish uh, what he was doing on top of the fact that he had been really uh, shook, I think, and, and misunderstood on uh, Batman versus Superman. And I think that a lot of people were worried about where he was, whether he was going to be able to recover from the, the critical reception of that film. And I think that it must have felt like an enormous loss to not get to finish that film and bring it out. And so to see how the fans really rallied around him and it's just that's amazing. I remember when I saw this other singer who also had not been able to uh, release a sophomore album. And again, it was the fans who went in there and had said, you know, we want to see, we want to hear that album. You need to release it. And they did. And because those fans were, were, you know, vocal enough and organized and they really were so organized online for Zach uh, in so many different ways. And then there were a lot of developments also at Warner Brothers and with streaming with the merger that then also created also HBO Max. And I, I guess that like Zach, you know, had recovered enough from his trauma to be able to say, you know, I could do it this way, but this is how I wanna get it done. And I just, I, first of all, it's so rare for a director to get this opportunity to do this. It's so rare for the fans to actually get to see the, the, the thing that they've been clamoring for. Um, so I am extremely happy for Zach and Deb and for the DC fans and for all of us that we get to see this creation. I look forward to sitting there for four hours straight uh, watching the whole thing.